Hey guys, it's Thunder Splash, and in this episode, we're going to be talking about how to make a pause menu in Unreal Engine 5. Alright, let's get into it. Alright, first we're going to go to Edit, and then go to Project Settings look for input click on the action mappings and type in pause then we're gonna click here click the keyboard and we're gonna click any letter you want after that we're gonna exit out of it now we're gonna right click go to user interface and look for user widget Rename it. And open it up. Next, we're gonna look for canvas and drag it onto our graph. After that, we're gonna type in blur. Resize it. and we're gonna change the blur strength to three. Next, we'll type in text, and we're gonna drag it into our graph. Gonna anchor it, resize it, and then we're gonna rename what's in the text box. After that, we're gonna look for a button. And we're going to drag it onto our graph. Now we're gonna resize it. Next, we're gonna anchor it. After that, we're gonna look for a text and we're going to attach it to our button. Now we're gonna change the text to resume. And for the button name, we're going to label it resume button. After that, we're gonna right click and duplicate. We're gonna rename this to quit button. And we're gonna change the text from resume to quit. Then we're gonna drag it in place. And after that, we're gonna anchor it. Next, we'll hit compile. Then we'll go to our resume button and we're going to look for on clicked. After that, we're going to right click, look for set input mode game only. Next, we'll right click again and look for get player controller. And we're going to connect return value to player controller. After that, we're gonna right click on the return value again and look for show mouse. Then we're gonna connect the set input mode game only to the mouse cursor. Then we're gonna right click and look for remove from parent. Then we're gonna right click again 
and look for set game paused. After that, we're gonna go back to the designer, make sure the quit button is clicked, and we're gonna look for on clicked. After that, we're gonna right click and look for quit game. Compile. Now we're gonna look for a third person character blueprint. Open it up. After that, we're gonna right click and look for paused under action events. Next, we'll right click and type flip flop. After that, we'll right click again on A and we'll look for create widget. We'll change our class to our widget, which is pause menu. Then we'll go to the return value, right click and look for add to viewport. Next, we'll right click, look for set game paused. Make sure the pause is checked off. Then we're gonna right click again and look for set input mode game and UI. After that, we're gonna right click, look for get player controller. And we're gonna connect the return value to player controller. After that, we'll click on return value again and look for show mouse cursor. We're gonna drag it over here and we're gonna connect the game and UI to the show mouse cursor. All right, let's clean this up a little bit. All right, cool. So after that, we're gonna to go to return value on pause menu widget and look for remove from parent. After that, we're gonna go back to the flip flop and connect B to return from parent. Next, we're gonna right click and look for set input mode game only. After that, we're gonna right click again and look for get player controller. We're gonna connect return value to player controller. And then we're gonna right click again on return value and look for show mouse cursor. After that, we're gonna connect the game only to the show mouse cursor. Clean this up over here. Then we're gonna right click on show mouse cursor and look for set game paused. All right, so now we're just gonna to check to make sure our blueprint looks good. All right, looks good, good. Uh, oh yes, and we need to make sure this is clicked. All right, cool, so this looks good. All right, compile, and then click play. And as you can see, whenever the player presses the letter Q, the game pauses. And when you click resume, the game resumes. And obviously when you click quit, the game quits. Hey guys, if you like these type of videos, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, share this video, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Later.